हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स प्लीज सब्सक्राइब द चैनल ड्रॉप अ लाइक शेयर एंड कमेंट दिस इज श्री विष्णु आर्ट प्रेस पब्लिकेशंस एक्सरसाइज नंबर थ्री एंड फोर ऑन द स्पीड ऑफ नाइन्टी वर्ड्स पर मिनट स्टार्ट द पेटिशनर वाज अ क्लास फोर्थ एम्प्लॉय इन द हेल्थ डिपार्टमेंट According to the respondents she was to retire on 31st July 2007 as her date of birth according to the medical certificate was 13th July 1947 and since she was allowed to continue beyond the said period an order was passed on 7th January 2008 retiring her from service forth with with a further direction of recovery of the amount of salary obtained by her after 31st July 2007 it is this order which is under challenge by the petitioner on the ground that the impugned order is founded on the strength of records which would not alter the status of the petitioner and that no information was given to the petitioner about any alteration in the date of birth as recorded in the service book the petitioner contends that the service book of the petitioner categorically records the date of birth of the petitioner as 13th July 1949 the petitioner was never put to notice about any such alteration and her date of birth continued to be recorded as such in the service book it is admitted that the aforesaid aspect of the matter that her date of birth was recorded as 13th july 1949 in the service book has not been disputed in the counter affidavit it is submitted that in the absence of any such alteration made there in the respondents could not have proceeded to pass the impugned order learned standing counsel on the other hand contends that the stand taken in the counter affidavit is that the petitioner was subjected to a medical test in the year 1996 and the medical certificate which was issued has been duly countersigned by her which indicates her date of birth as 13th july 1947 on the strength of the said document it is urged that the impugned order has been rightly passed as the petitioner was aware of her date of birth as 13th july 1947 and she cannot now be permitted to challenge the same it is further indicated in the counter affidavit that during an inspection the aforesaid fact came to the notice of the authorities where after action was taken and an order had already been passed to refund the salary which has been paid in excess for the period beyond 31st july 2007 before expressing any opinion in the merits of the impugned order it would be appropriate to record that when the field is already occupied by a statutory rule then the authority ought to have noticed the same before having proceeded to take any action the impugned order nowhere indicates the consideration of the 
1974 rules referred to here in above it appears that the date of birth which was mentioned in the medical certificate dated 23rd april 1996 has been taken to be conclusive proof of the date of birth of the petitioner the said document is a medical certificate which was prepared at the time of the confirmation of the services of the petitioner against the judgment of trial court civil appeal number 23 2013 was preferred which was heard and allowed by the judgment dated 21 11 by additional district judge court number 5 balia in its judgment the first appellate court had held that in present case sale deed in question had been properly executed after which the mutation of name of defendant was carried out disputed agricultural property the first appellate court had held that in present contract of sale and execution of registered sale deed in question time of payment of remaining sale consideration was not essence of the contract for transferring ownership of disputed property which was transferred by sale deed in question from plaintiff to defendant so the said property executed sale deed cannot be cancelled because it was neither voidable nor void but for default in performing his promise of payment of remaining consideration plaintiff is entitled to recover remaining consideration or damages from the defendant aggrieved by the judgment of first appellate court present second appeal was preferred by plaintiff of original suit learned counsel for the appellant contended that since it was agreed between the parties and in sale deed dated 27 2004 in question that the time for payment remaining consideration of rupees 164000 is essence of the contract for sale and since said amount was not paid by defendant therefore the sale deed in question is liable to be cancelled and judgment of trial court in this regard is correct and proper which should be upheld learned counsel for the respondent contended that payment of remaining consideration of rupees 164000 was not essence of contract of sale had this been essence of contract for sale then plaintiff would not have given consent before revenue court at the time of mutation of name of defendant which was carried out after one month of execution of sale deed he contended that defendant was ready and willing to pay remaining rupees 164000 of unpaid consideration but plaintiff and his brother colluded and thereafter the plaintiff's brother had filed another suit for permanent injunction about the property sold by plaintiff in which stay order had been passed by the concerned court therefore the defendant was unable to pay remaining consideration in spite of his willingness 
he further contended that at the best plaintiff can get payment of consideration of rupees 164000 he further contended that in fact this amount was deposited in court by defendant or respondent therefore there is no error in judgment of first appellate court and this appeal should be dismissed in limine admittedly the parties had entered into a contract for sale and in compliance of which registered sale deed in question was executed by plaintiff in favor of defendant it is also admitted case that part of the consideration had been paid at the time of execution of sale deed in question and for remaining part of sale consideration it was written in sale deed that it will be paid within 1 month by defendant to plaintiff it is also admitted that remaining consideration was not paid by the defendant till the institution of the suit